going on guys this is another video and i'm going to try to be doing this as often as i can but in today's video we're going to be basically prepping the fender and painting it to put on the headlights and doing everything that i want to do with the car and right now we already sanded it down we did this thing because it's like it has something so it will show in the paint when it's done so we're trying to do it as perfect as we can make it look nice make it look good make it show ready obviously we're going to be replacing this fender and this headlight and it's gonna be a big mess, but right now I have to go to Lowe's, go get some stuff that we need to get, and this thing will be close to done, hopefully soon. And this car has a lot of spiders, so we gotta be we gotta be careful with that. Some of them could be venomous. We don't know, but little by little we'll be getting it done and perfect show car ready. Dang, I think that's a Supra. We got everything from the Lowe's and AutoZone and the thing, car cover, bunch of sprays. I don't even know what it's called. Chop towels. What do we get, dude? What are these? Primer, uh, really? No, that's the uh, uh, addition for more. That, yeah. Oh. This hook is going to come in handy. Chop towels and microfiber. But this right here. This glass thing. Best one, hands down. This came like a little damage from Subaru. Not damaged, but something happened. And we tried fixing it, but clearly it didn't really work. Cause you can feel it, but we'll find something out. So right now you're trying to take it off so it can be flat. When you spray the primer, it won't be. Yeah, I had like a little nick there. Yeah. It has three of them, no? It's kind of yeah. like this one down here. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Project WRX coat of primer, which is right here, the filler, because if we were to leave it, you would see it through the paint, right? Yeah. Okay. So right now we're just trying to make it flat so it can look good when it's done, when we spray the paint. Cause it kind of like some like you can say like like rock chips. So we're trying to make it look flat, make it look good. Show car ready, you know. But little by little, this thing we we'll have headlights on, the new fender, and prestige condition. We gotta wait 40 minutes, let the primer dry so we can make it flat, and then we're gonna spray it again with another primer, and we are gonna get it prepped for painting. But, right now, I'm gonna be playing some Need for Speed Heat to wait the 40 minutes. Right now we got some, we got about 20 minutes left. It's been 30 minutes, now it's time to what? Sand it down, right? Yeah, we're gonna scuff it, and then put some uh, sealer. And we're gonna do the edges first, and then uh, paint. So this thing right. Mmm. Mmm. That's what some kitan the roughness kept it up the lower spring. Yeah. We're removing that and then we're gonna we're gonna put it on prime on, on a sealer too. Because it's silver that we're spray, spraying and then uh, yeah. get back and say it looks good, you know. Master mechanic here. Years of experience, right? Yeah. Came out pretty good, dude. This thing, thank God we don't have to work on the floor. He has to work on the floor because he's the expert in this and I don't really know a lot. So I don't want to mess up and, you know, he's the expert pro. Anything that's on this and you spray whatever you spray on it, it will have a reaction. So we do not want that. So right now we're using the glass cleaner to get all oils stripped away from the metal. Make sure it's not just gonna spill. Oh, so it's clear. It's clear. It's just make to make the paint stick a little more. Uh huh. But uh, I just like to use it on. The face. Yeah, and that's what we're gonna be painting. Yeah. Yeah. Easy to motor. Yeah. Oh, 
with the edges with sealer and we're gonna come attack it later on the, in the center and then we're gonna leave it overnight to let it cure and we're gonna paint it tomorrow so that is dried we're going to attack the black parts and yeah Dang, bro. I should put it up for sale. Plus the WRX. Super man. That's done. We're gonna have to come back tomorrow, let it dry, and yeah. Now that it's the second day, um, it's now ready to be painted, like on around the edges with uh, with this with this color. I forgot what it's called. It's like a metallic silver. And as you guys saw, I did order these little carbon fiber reflector pieces that go right on top of there. That would look really nice. I don't know if I should put the sticker on. I kind of like it, but I also kind of don't. Probably will put it on because it looks cool when it's on. And this thing's ready. And let's get to it. Gotta make sure we clean, keep everything clean, you know? Mm -hmm. This is how the outcome is. Right now it's kind of awkward since the sun is kind of hitting at a weird angle. So when it, if this, I don't, like, right, if it's too hot, then it would just cause issues, right? Uh, yeah. It can be too hot. It has to be like a normal room temperature. Yeah. But so far so good. Everything looks good, right? It's not awkward. Oh, it's not, it's not focusing. We got all the cars protected from any overspray because obviously we're not gonna mess up anything because you know I mean this is the future that we're using. I don't even really know what it is, but yeah. Car we're mainly protecting the basically the front grills and the turn signal size, and that's what we worked on. This car needs a respray either way because it's not it's not it's it just needs paint. That's what it needs. So that's why we're not really protecting this car as much. This one doesn't really need that much paint, so that's why we're going to be protecting it the most. And yeah, hopefully this thing comes out well. We're going to have an exhaust fan coming out here, where it can just throw out all the things over there and you know paint stuff. You know, I believe that this thing will work out pretty well, and hopefully it will look nice. I have faith, and let's go. This is the after, but we still need to let it dry for a little bit. Just the edges. Just the edges, yeah, and then maybe tomorrow we're gonna put it on. Hopefully later today, but we don't know yet. We gotta see it. And this is like a three-day process video, so yeah. So we need to take off the side skirt, we need to take off the fender, we need to tape up everything, we gotta do all this and like he says, you can't mix mechanic with the paint, so yeah. A couple hours we let it dry for a little bit so it looks it looks amazing 
but now we gotta take off the f passenger fender and let, we gotta basically replace everything put it on and then we're gonna paint match it to the car with the door and make it fade and yeah if you know you know <laughs> 